If there is a theme this week, could it be instability? There'll be a flurry of meetings on the UK's EU membership, the NATO Secretary General pops in to talk conflicts, and there'll be a mini plenary. Welcome to the agenda. I can't give a guarantee for an outcome of a future uh, legislation. The message from the European Parliament to David Cameron couldn't be clearer, it would seem. As talks continue, Parliament's Constitutional Affairs Committee will hold a meeting with the Commission's Strategic Task Force on the UK referendum on Tuesday. There's nothing like a bit of forward planning. A NATO summit is scheduled for July, but that's not putting off the Secretary General who will be at the Parliament to talk strategy on Tuesday. With ongoing conflicts in the Middle East and North Africa, Jan Stoltenberg will put collective defence at top of the list of his talking points as he sits in on a joint Foreign Affairs and Security and Defence Committee meeting on Tuesday. The EU High Representative for Foreign Affairs, Federica Mogherini, will also be at the same meeting, but a bit earlier. Environment Committee MEPs opposed it, but a veto didn't pass go at the plenary. So now what will they say at a public hearing on diesel car emissions? Will the new proposals improve air quality? Are they too lenient on car manufacturers, especially in the wake of the Volkswagen scandal? Experts will be invited to discuss with MEPs on Tuesday. And now for a quick look at what's on at the Brussels mini plenary. On day one, one of the big debates will be on the European semester. Can better economic governance take Europe to economic stability and beyond? A vote on the European network of employment services follows on Thursday. Can they be used better to help with the mobility of workers across the EU? And finally, how best to prevent disease in animals? Various pieces of legislation are being merged together in the hope that they could act as a stopper. The use of antibiotics to treat sick animals also comes under the scope. But apart from livestock, rare breeds and even stray dogs will be given greater protection. Watch the debate on Tuesday to find out more. And that's all we have this agenda. Take care and enjoy the week.